What up, everybody? Um, today I'm checking out the Burger King Philly Mail new item and uh, mozzarella fries. So they have like a, some type of anniversary of some sort, 72 years or I don't know something like that. But they got a Philly melt and a mozzarella fries. They got some wraps. They got a birthday cake or pie or something. But today I'm just doing the melt and uh, mozzarella fries. You know. Bam. Let's get into it. Go straight for that melt. All right. Little. Nice and wrapped up here. Let's check this out. Okay. Okay. Looks like you got some type of mayonnaise, maybe. Cheese is melty on there. There we go. Got some peppers on there. Some red peppers, onions, green peppers, some melty Swiss, I think, which is kind of weird. And um, and two burger patties. Yep. Okay. They toasted the top bun, which is cool. But the bottom bun is not toasted, I don't know. I don't know why not, but it's all right. I'll take I'll take the top toasted bun. Looking good. Off the rip is not bad. The the pepper mix is uh, gives it a good flavor. The two patties make it meaty. You look. They were kind of packed. I don't know if it's both sides are supposed to be toasted, but there was a long uh, wait line. The cheese uh, is different. Cost about six bucks. I didn't get the combo. I just got the the patty melt. How much does it cost? Five forty nine. So five fifty without taxes. So about six bucks. Um, not gonna lie, I kind of like it. I like it. Uh, the sauce on it gives it a good flavor too. I don't know if it's some type of aioli or something. I haven't ate at Burger King in a long time, but it's not bad for a little six dollar sandwich. Not bad. I don't know why they call it a Philly melt. Maybe because of bell peppers and I don't know. Because, um, you know, Philly, they don't put melted Swiss cheese. But, hey, it's their version of some type of melt. Probably trying to compete with Whataburger. not bad I like it for a little six six bucks give it a good a good seven seven point oh uh, I was in the mood for some vitamin water all 
All right, let's get into these. Oops. <clears throat> All right. Now let's get into this mozzarella sticks. I mean, they're actually mozzarella fries. Okay, it's like a skinny cheese sticks. Hmm. The breading is good. Very slim. They're just like cheese sticks, maybe, but like skinnier. No, they had some marinara sauce in here. Dang, dang, give me no marinara sauce. Oh, man. Is it in the bag? No, man. Damn it. I don't feel like going back neither. Oh, well. I waited too long for that. <laughs> well, I guess I'm just going to rate them off the cheese stick. I asked them too, man. I was like, is there marinara in there? They're like, yeah, it's marinara. I was like, all right. Freaking fast food places, bro. That's why I don't like eating there. <laughs> they can't never get something right. Uh, all in all, these, uh, these are kind of slim for me. More bready and less cheesy. I give them a... Out of cheese sticks, I give it a 5.5. I like the I like the milk. It's cool, you know. It's different. I like the pepper mix. Pro to me, what sets it off is the the pepper and onion mix that sets off this sandwich right there. That's probably where all the points came from. I was in the mood for some vitamin water. I was like, I'll just go across the street and give me some drinks over there. As far as these cheese sticks, I'm a little bit disappointed I didn't get the marinara. I might just drive over there across the street. They're cool little fries. I'm trying with one of these ketchups. Mm. I mean, it's better than just eating them dry, but... Whatever, they're all right. They're all right. You know, I don't expect too much when I go to fast food restaurants, especially something one like Burger King, you know, which has gone down over the years. You know, Chick-fil-A is up there with the customer service and stuff. 
So I didn't expect, expect much from Burger King. But, hey, it's worth a try. I think y'all should try it out. Definitely, um, if anything, I might go back and get like a, a Whopper. I haven't tried a Whopper in a while. But I really like the pepper mix they put on that sandwich right there. They did have the new wraps too. Might go back another day for one to check those out before they expire. But appreciate y'all watching me. Hit that like, hit that subscribe if you ain't done it yet. Peace.